Hello and welcome to the Nexus. Today we're still on pack 8 of our Knight Rider build and we're doing issue 29 of that pack which has got a rear, a, a, a quite a big section actually which I think is the rear wheels, oops, uh, the rear part of the car but we've got a lot to do till then so uh, let's crack it open and get going. <laughs> Okay, so these are the parts that we get in this issue. We get the rear section of the car. We get a plastic section here. We get a little clip and some wires. But before we do any of that, we need our engine and the front part of our chassis that we've already built as well. Because we're going to be inserting the engine into the chassis of the car. So that's what we're going to be doing. We also need the EM screws that we had in the last issue. So that's the bits that we've got there. Uh, I'm just going to try and uh, bring over the chassis section, which is here, like so. Uh, look, there we go. Okay. Um, so we're going to try and maneuver everything. We've still got this wire as well from the last issue. I'm going to push this over like that. And the first thing we're going to do is stick our engine in. So here's our engine. So we're going to put it in like so. And there we go. It's all about uh, sort of uh, maneuvering it so it can go in. And obviously we are going to be, hang on, let me... Uh, there we go all right okay so if we if we uh tip it it's a, it's a really tight gap a very very tight gap actually there we go and it's all about just maneuvering it in that's it there we go look at that right so it's 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 in thereabouts <laughs> uh so we're gonna uh, secure it in place with some em screws just there so we're gonna very very carefully put two em screws in there so i'm going to do that now okay, so the engine is in place uh we've got to connect up some wires so the first one is this one that pokes through that's just gonna collect on to uh, that box there like so now there is another one which is uh, sort of down here and that is going to connect onto here I'm going to do that in just a second our spare wire that we've got that is going to go on to this end of the battery if we can get it on there that is <laughs> and then that is going to then connect to this little uh, there is one just here I can connect that one on and then that is going to go to that battery terminal here. So we're going to connect it onto here to there. And the spare one that we have, which is just here, like so, I'm going to have to poke it through here. That is going to go onto this battery terminal here. Uh, also as well, which I forgot to do, is... Uh, whoop, there goes the camera. Is this wire here, this uh, pipe that's down here, I don't know if you can make that out there is a pipe just here that is going to go on here so i'm hopefully just going to have to turn it and we'll get it in there it's all right okay so that's all wired up now um <laughs> i to be fair i i'm not too fussed about the wiring and stuff like that. i don't know how much i'm going to be looking under the hood of this when it's complete uh or anything like that but we are now working on, on the back section of this on the bits that we received in this issue so I'm going to put this aside for a second and I'm just going to bring up this part here we also need our battery pack as well which is here 
So do you remember when we got our battery pack? So firstly what we're going to do is flip it over, like so. And we are going to place this in here like so. And we're going to secure it down with AM screws. We're also going to put in our, uh, our switch as well using AM screws as well, which will go into this little slot here. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to go ahead and do that now and just secure that in with the AM screws. Okay, so we've done that. We've secured the uh, switch in and the battery box. And that's what it should look like. And the switch moves fairly well. Good. Keeping it up like this, we're going to take our uh, back seat cover section here. Which isn't, but it just, <laughs> just looks like it. And we're going to secure that just on there like that. And we are going to secure that down with BP screws. So one in there, one in there. And one in there so i'm going to do that now okay so those are in like that so that's how that should look which is a bit weird with it so far up as well it looks a bit it does look strange but it it's apparently what it's supposed to be i, I reckon we're going to be feeding maybe this through here i don't know anyway <laughs> so next one we're going to do is we've got this little bracket here and that is going to sit on there and we're going to secure that down with uh, AM screws so I'm going to do that now okay so we've done that that's just there now we're going to attach this section to the rest of the car and we'll see the full size of this so that is going to go on there like that and we're going to use GM screws We've got one, two, three, four, two either side and the one in the middle there. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. And then we'll take a look at the full size. And um, it's a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. Let's just put it that way. So let's do that now. Okay, so that's issue 29. And as you can see, we now have the full size of our car. And it's huge. Uh, like I said, though, it is a little bit smaller. I am bit, Obviously, I've been working on a Dodge Charger and obviously that is huge <laughs> compared to this but it's it's getting there it's getting quite big now as you can see it's on this um which is uh i think this is an a5 i believe no 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 i think it, it's the other way it's an a4 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 is normal size uh a3 that's it so you can sort of see it's, it it goes end to end so it's it's getting there it's getting there um Obviously, the back wheels have got to go on yet and stuff like that. There's still a long way for us to go here on the Nexus. But that is it for uh, this issue of Pack 8. Thank you for watching. And as always, we'll see you at the next video. Take it easy.